Actually, this isn't even a sidewalk. This is a road, believe it or not. You can see everyone's running out to get their stuff as quickly as possible. It's amazing, what I originally thought is a sidewalk is actually part of the road and it's completely blocked. You've got vehicles here, you've got booths or vendors that are selling stuff. It's all coming down. And these guys work fast. This whole area is going to be clear. You just wait and watch. It is a little bit sad for those that own this, but at the same time, this is really a problem. Every single day I get messages from people saying, hey, come to this area, come to this area. It is everywhere. It's impossible for like one agency to clear this up, uh, especially not overnight. It really comes down to the LTUs. They have to be the ones that really like step up the game. Uh, but for now, I actor here, MMDA here, the street clearing, the sidewalk clearing, the Paranaki boys, the HPG, the AFP, everyone's here trying to do their bit. And you can see there's actually electrical wires run between all of these. Um, so you can guess that that's probably not legit wiring. They're moving fast to clear this area up. Look at how clear it's already becoming. You can actually see a road again after it. It's incredible. This is what people have been asking for. Clear the sidewalks, clear the roads, improve traffic. It's happening right now. Now, of course, in reality, if you go one street over, one street over, one street over, there's so many other roads like this and they can't hit them all, especially not at the same time. Uh, but they're really trying. So, yeah, just have to support them in trying and just keep pushing forwards. You can see some people rushing to take their goods away. You can see they've collected quite a few of these umbrellas. We're just tying them up now. Look at the huge difference compared to when we first arrived. And that was only about five minutes ago. They work very, very fast. It avoids conflict and it's just better efficiency so they can move on to the next area as quickly as possible. Although they're definitely going to need some extra trucks and I'm not sure how many they've got with them today. Hopefully they've got some more down the road. So you can see they're tying the tricycles to the back of the tow trucks. Um, but otherwise this whole area is being cleared now. There's just some trash on the floor that needs to be removed. But otherwise, it's done. It's, you know, it's all been taken away. Here goes one tow truck, pretty heavily loaded. Everything on the back and then the three tricycles at the back. So they have to be very careful about how they tow this. So no one's turned up to drive this truck away. Um, some people did just get in to drive it away but they weren't actually the owner or the driver so Teddy scared them away um, the vehicle's going to be towed away basically it's parked on the sidewalk partially blocking the road also um, so they'll take this one away no drivers turned up and we've already been here for about 20 minutes so earlier they moved that pickup truck from the road which was illegally parked onto the sidewalk which is still illegally parked Road. It's funny that this guy just pulled up and said, oh, can I park here? And he's literally like about to drive up to the tow truck. I thought, oh, that's excellent. You're going to save them the job of towing it away. You can just drive straight on there. So yeah, amazing. Look, it's actually a road again. It's a clear road. 